Hello ladies and gentlemen, now with me there is a girl, her name is Akansha Pawar and she is going to really speak, uh, you know, really with the enthusiasm exactly before you now. Uh, let's see the what happens now, actually, I don't know actually uh, also her speech, but well, let's see the what happens now. I'd like to ask some question to her, excuse me ma, tell me how are you feeling? I'm feeling very good. So are you happy with this, uh, you know, your transformation? Yes sir, I'm very happy. That's great. Do you speak English? Yes sir. All right, I let's will. see what happens I here. Speak. And is everything okay? Yes sir, everything. And how is everything? All everything is well? Everything is all well. And do you want to also defeat everyone? Yes sir, I'm As Anjali said that I'm going to defeat yes, everyone. Yes sir, I'm, I am also uh, going uh -huh. to defeat each and every person here. Oh my God, that's great. Okay, let's see that now what happens. Thank you so much. Life needs a superpower that pushes you up. And that superpower is Guru. Guru is everything. Nothing is possible without Guru. So good afternoon, sir, and hello, everyone. I am Akanksha, and today I am going to speak on the topic of Guru. So I personally feel Guru is uh, a very powerful word. So first of all, I would like to recite you a very beautiful story so that you will understand the word Guru more betterly. So once upon a time, there was a beautiful small kingdom where the king and their praja lives very happily. Uh, the king was so obedient to his guru. He always do everything by after asking or discussing with his guru. Once upon a time, their neighborhood country attacked on them, which is almost more than uh, uh, three times more than their army. Uh, they attacked on their, their defeat is totally uh, confirmed that they are going to defeat. But uh, uh, the commander already ran away because he know he is born to die. The uh, king also uh, decided that he, he is going to surrender the another guru, uh, uh, the another uh, uh, king. But before this, he goes uh, for final discussion to his guru. Uh, the guru said that uh, this is not the solution. You should not uh, run away from your problems. You have to face it. You have to fight. And after that, uh, if you will defeat, uh, this will be your proud death. So uh, the king said, it's all right, but our commander already ran away. So how will we fight? How, who will command our, uh, uh, who will command our uh, army? The guru said, I will command your army for this war. And after that, uh, you will uh, decide whatever you want to do. The guru start commanding all the armies. He said that we all, we all know we are going to defeat. But if God is with us, that uh, we all are going to win. In between, the, when they are going to the battleground, in between they saw a temple. He said the, that uh, before uh, reaching to the battleground, we all have to just pray once to the God that if he will support us, we are going to just won this war. Everyone agreed and just go to the uh, temple. No one uh, is inside the temple. The Guru said if the bell start ringing automatically without anybody uh, efforts, then it will definitely mean that God is with us and we are going to win. After this, uh, everyone sat outside the temple and, uh, and closed their eyes and start praying. The God said uh, the, uh, the uh, bell start ringing automatically and each and every person filled with lots of confidence and they all know that God is with us and we all are going to uh, win. They all uh, go for uh, battle and they won from more than uh, for from their three times more than army and after that they uh, just won and uh, they come back to the to their kingdom and thank the commander the guru. The guru said don't thank me I'm just I, I just showed you the path. Uh, uh, I I I um, rang the bell, and after that, uh, you all automatically filled with confidence, and you all are the reason we are won today. So after this, uh, through this story, we are just uh, we are just uh, no. We all know that Guru is everything, and without uh, him. We are nothing. We can't do anything. If uh, there was no guru, we are uh, not going to choose the right path. The real guru will always show us path and always uh, tell us that we are uh, we should not uh, uh, run away from our problems and just always uh, uh, always be with 
uh, all confidence and do whatever we uh, are going to do and face all the problems. So thank you and I hope you all will uh, uh, respect your Guru and obey your Guru. Thank you.